Hey guys, tomorrow I have an on-site sawmill job and today I've got a broken sawmill. Now what happened, I had a piece of wood chalking the wheel on my sawmill and I lowered the, leg, the lifting arms down and there's a flow control piece that sticks out of the back of the cylinder there. And when I, when I lowered it down, it came and it, it cracked the fitting and I didn't realize it. And I was trying to load the log. I was just spraying hydraulic fluid all over the ground. So I've got the new fitting and I've got some Dextron 3 to add to the hydraulic system. So I'm going to put on the new fitting and show you where the hydraulic fluid goes and get this thing up and ready for tomorrow. The part is actually called a velocity fuse and it looks like this. It's got small ports. Goes right here. I was able to get the broken threads out of the cylinder with an easy out pretty easily. I don't know if you can see that little arrow, but there's an arrow and that needs to point away from the cylinder, like that. I'm going to put some Teflon tape on here. When you're putting Teflon tape on threads, you want to look at the end that's going to go into the fitting. Start with your tape and come around the right side. And that way, when you thread it in, your, your thread tape won't unravel as you thread it in. And I'm starting on the top and I'm wrapping around to the right or clockwise. About three wraps. Now the hydraulic pump and reservoir are inside the control box here. Wonder how that sawdust got in there. See if I can do this without a funnel. That's getting pretty close. I'm going to cycle the hydraulics and, oh shoot, I can't. All right, <clears throat> I'm gonna move the saw head back here so that I can cycle the hydraulics and see how much it goes down. Now, in case you didn't know, the saw head has to be making contact with this copper strip in order for the hydraulics to work. And I cycled the hydraulics back and forth a couple times. That should work all the air out. Just check the level one more time. Oh yeah, went down quite a bit.
right, show of hands, how many of you thought I was going to spill hydraulic fluid all over the inside of that compartment? Six? Six of you? Okay. That's not too bad. I thought I was going to spill it all over the place, but it went pretty well. Thanks for watching guys. Um, I'm going to fill up my blade lube bottle and the gas tank and put my tools away, throw some blades in the truck and I am going to head out to an on-site job tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. Also today I took my John Deere tractor to work with me with the box blade and graded a road um, all day long today and it worked really awesome. Uh, I filmed it. I'm going to edit that out and get that posted here shortly. But uh, again, thanks for watching and stay tuned. I got some cool stuff coming up.